Shalom family. So now you've heard a lot of people talking about Revelation 6, the four horses of the apocalypse. And their colors, white, red, black. So pretty much that image you've seen discussed many times. And on top of that image, we've also pointed out that it's interesting. Those are reflected so perfectly in all of these Islamic nations, which would tell you it's almost like a warning of where this destruction and famine and everything is going to be coming through from what sector. So now you know all of this, and I have had an argument presented to me before where it says the pale horse is pale, so like an off-white, not green. Now if I look at the interlinear, and I looked and behold a horse pale, the Greek word here is chloros, right? Chloros, green, pale green, greenish. So definitely green. Same root word that you'd probably get for chlorine and things like that, but green. So it's definitely a green horse. So that aside, the interesting thing, if you were still unsure that there is an Islamic connection to these colors and these horses, I want you to look at the flag of Morocco. The flag of Morocco, used by the government of Morocco, has served as the national flag since 17 November 1915. So it's not a new thing. It has a blood red field with a green pentagram in the center. The green star represents the five pillars of Islam and the red represents the blood of the ancestors and unity rivers of blood that they rise on and the pentagram a symbol for satanists and other cults around the world that clearly points to who they worship makes up the five pillars of islam isn't that interesting like one of them is clearly showing you who they worship and what's coming so bracing myself for all the comments from muslims that are going to hop on this one but it's all there for us to see if you look Interesting. Keep looking up, keep watching, keep spreading the gospel. Shalom.